the world's like. When you turn on the news, what do you see? Well, between all the violence and war and terrorism and the AIDS pandemic and global warming, we've got to say our world's pretty messed up. What's interesting is how we feel about that. Uh, none of us think that that's a great thing. All of us long and ache for a better world. Well, isn't that interesting? Because um, hunger seems to point to the fact that food exists and thirst points to the fact that water or drink exists. So our longing and aching for a better world seems to point to the fact that either a better world did exist or will one day exist. Well, in the Christian worldview, we believe it did. And that um, back in the day, um, God designed it so that the planet took care of us and we took care of it and we took care of each other and God took care of us and we blessed him back and that the whole thing was designed for good. So how did we get here? Well, we decided that we were going to run the show and when we started chasing our own needs above caring for other people or the planet, we started damaging the planet, we started damaging our relationship with each other, and ultimately we damaged our relationship with God so that the whole thing was damaged by evil. Well, it's great that God actually loves the planet and us too much to leave us that way. So even in our brokenness, in the Christian worldview 2,000 years ago, God came as Jesus. And in that, he started to teach us a better way to live and began to tell us about this thing called the reign of God, where all the good things that's supposed to happen actually do. And so he taught us, and in his death, all this crap died with him so that three days later, when he came back to life, there's new life possible throughout everything, throughout the planet, in us, and with each other. And so everything is being restored for better. Well, then what's our response? Well, in this world, that's still messed up. Jesus is starting a revolution, and he's asking us to be healed ourselves in Jesus' name, to be healed in each other, and to go out and heal the planet and that our mission is to be sent together to heal. Now how come I can't just jump from here to here? This sounds great. Well, the world's problems are infinite and we're gonna get overwhelmed trying to take care of this on our own. We actually need Jesus' resources so that we can become the kind of good that we wanna see on the planet. And that's crucial. So where are you? Are you here where you think the world is peachy? Or here, overwhelmed by the world's problems? Or are you here, got some sense of God working in your life, but not involved in his mission? Or you're here, you're trying to actually make this world a better place, relationships and you and everything, but have a hard time finding how God fits into the picture. Where are you?